Okay, welcome back to Prison Architect. So this is episode four. Last episode, uh, it hasn't come out yet to you guys. I am recording before it, it gets released, but I, I'm anticipating people going, oh, you're starting again. Uh, but we're, we're now basically at a point that we've never been, which is good. Um, so we can start doing stuff that you guys have never seen. Um, but let's also start like doing some other stuff and researching other stuff. So I also noticed while I was editing and watching this back, that I made that into a cell randomly, you know. I am going to make weird mistakes while recording because you get distracted while um, you do really random things. Um, so today's episode, obviously we have our prisoners actually arriving because we don't actually have any prisoners as of yet. And I would say we're going to need about five more, five more guards. So we'll have 20 guards because 51 prisoners arriving on our first ever intake is going to be quite a bit. Now, obviously, we nearly still have 100,000. So what I'm actually aiming for today's episode is I'm most likely going to try and get to the intelligence part. And then we might start getting to building a separate wing. As I mentioned to you guys, and if you watched episode one and two, occasionally somebody died if they were a snitch. That happens. So now we also got to hire a gardener, and then we get one of these grants complete. There we go. Um, but yeah, if you're a snitch, you can get killed, especially having different... Um... God, we got that one straight away. Um, especially if you have different security levels to give. If you have medium sec with high sec or low sec with medium, that tends to be a recipe for disaster as well. So eventually, we will actually probably have separate wings for every single one. So like this main prison bulk here, because it's right at the entrance, this might be min sec. So people that don't really fight and they just kind of get along with their sentence and that's it. Up here, we might make medium sec up here and then we'll make a maximum security sec with a small um, super max sec and then also deaths, death row. And we can have one of those as well. So that's, that's what this prison is. Now, I will also say it's pretty cool um, that I noticed in the comments people were going, I just picked up this game because you're making videos. Honestly, that's a really cool thing for me to see. That's a really cool thing for me to see because I've, if you don't know, I did a game design degree and supporting indie devs that make small games, gets them greenlit on Steam is amazing. You know, the, you are making uh, these people have jobs in essence, which I, I'm sure they'd be very grateful for. Um, but anyway, let's plan what we're going to do next. So we're waiting three hours. Let's speed it up. Three hours until the prisoners arrive. Is there anything that we need, like, right now? I don't really think so. I think we have everything that they will need. It's just what we what we can add. Also, it's probably worth... And we can put prisoners in here. It's probably worth actually giving them more stuff. More cookers, more fridges. Because I wasn't expecting to have 50 prisoners from number one. Something else just got researched. I'm not really sure what. Did I research something? We'll also get a new cook. Or another cook. Make sure that we're not understaffed when they all arrive. What did we research? Um, I'm not actually sure. Something. People are going probably like, y you did that. And yeah, I have no idea. Let's get education because we can start doing education too. Right. So let's go in planning. Oh, actually quickly. What, what rooms do we want? So today I said I want to research that point. But what do we actually want to get to? Hmm. Oh, we need a morgue. I forgot. I forgot. I need a morgue, and we can just make a little one like here. That fits quite nicely over here. Did we do heating? We did not do heating as of yet for our prison. Okay, that was that's going to be what we're going to be aiming for really quickly. Um, so we're going to put the heating here. I'm going to try and make it reach as much as we can. It's not going to get up to here. We're going to need another one. Do we want it there? I've got to think because am I going to expand going down here? Most likely. Or am I not? Nah, I might actually just have a corridor. So yeah, we'll put it there. Screw it. We're committing. Okay, so power. Ooh, see, now I want to make sure that I have the my valve system that I like so much. So like that, we got a valve. And then hot water pipe is coming out. So we go up hot water pipe. And then make it go across to here. And then all the way like that. So if we just have a radiator like here, I think that would work. If we can make it go up a little bit on each that would also be fantastic just to make these all toasty and nice and warm these guys can't get into these because we don't have deployment yet Ooh, oh oh whoa, 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 whoa. okay so welcome prisoners oh my god look how busy it is oh my jesus all right okay is that all of them that's all 50 there right 
This is going to be fun. I think that's all 50. Incoming call. Uh-oh, do we have a, an event? An event is happening. Incoming call. A recent high-profile gang case has implemented or implicated one of your minimum security prisons as a high-ranking gang leader. They've remained under the radar, but now everyone knows who they are. Oh, boy. Who is it? I don't have intelligence. How am I supposed to know? Um, prisoners. Low risk. So it's one of these. Is it you? I don't think so. What a weird name. Um, is it you, Morgan? Hello? No? I don't know how I'm going to tell if I don't have intelligence. I know intelligence is going to be getting researched. It is right now. But I have no idea. All right. Okay. Well, someone might die. <laughs> Should we start building towards our minimum security? Shall we? Also, I noticed uh, because of the comment section, people were telling me, uh, yeah, people couldn't get to visitation because I set the reception as staff only. Good shout, everybody. Well done. Um, I won't do that this time. Um, I might need to set that separately, but anyway. Um, also, when I set this to staff only, people going, oh, come prisoners not working there? No, because when you set... Um... Oh, wait, really? I thought you could. I thought when you give these staff... When you make it staff only and give prisoners jobs, I believe they came became staff, no? Maybe they don't anymore. Maybe that they changed that. If I'm maybe I'm wrong. I always thought that used to be what it was. But apparently no. Um why is this not working? Because this pipe has not been finished. Uh let's I wanna get the heating done because heating could be a a risk thing for us, couldn't it? We don't want any riots. That's why I made a new prison, as you guys know. Um, but I think we're going to start making our uh, protected custody section. Because if we're already having, like, a gang leader, blah, 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 and snitches, I don't really want riots. So we can... Is that guard actually really... Okay, hang on. So there's a new one called access only. Let's change that to access only staff. So what this does is it basically means that guards and that will not use this corridor as an escort corridor. Because obviously staff members or guards can take prisoners through staff areas if they're escorting them. But having no access will mean that they don't go that way. I don't want prisoners to go that way. Also, we'll do it to this one because... Um, they could pick up random stuff. You know, if a prisoner's in the proximity of where they could pick up contraband, they're going to pick up contraband. Um, right, I think we could just expand this corridor going this way for a while. Literally, we're going to expand the prison a long way this way. And then what we'll probably do is we'll probably go up to go to maximum sec or something and then down to go to min sec and protect it. Or, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll decide when we get there. For now, we're just going to do some random corridors that kind of just go random places because... Again, I like my prisons to feel kind of spont spontaneous is the right word, I think. Uh, I don't like them to be really predictable because they just look boring to me. Um, so we've got a corridor going down. So now we can start planning. So we don't need a very big protected custody area. Like, if we just kind of plan out this big building and try to build everything within this big building, I think that honestly would be great. So what we could probably do is how many did we actually make it? We made it 29 on the inside probably want it third no we want it to be in 29 so um to there so we have 14 and 13 wait is that right yeah okay so we do need one more and get rid of that line so that's where the big building is going to be so we're going to make everything uh like this so this is going to be the main corridor that goes through the middle um like that and then everything will come off this corridor so if we can make cells Little cell blocks, again, protected custody. It's not going to be that big. Honestly, this might even be too big for protected custody. And then we'll get rid of a line down like that. And we'll make it go like this. And what did I got rid of two, wasn't it? I think. So there. Uh, there. There. And there. And then like that. So that's going to be our building. So this square here. We're only going to have two, like this amount of cells, I think. For now, I think that's manageable. If we need more, then we can always expand to the left. But this will be like 8 and 8. So we'll have 16 protected custody slots. We're all... Wait. Mm, actually, I just thought we don't want one corridor. That's making it a bit too confined. We can definitely have a two corridor. Two corridor isn't going to stretch us that much, is it? 
Especially if we are only having 16 people in this uh, cell block. Uh, again, the reason why I'm making this is to avoid snitches dying. So if I can find out who the snitches are, I'll move them to protected custody. And uh, they can have a little bit less stress on their hands. Um, I don't know why the builders aren't building. Or is that just plan? That's not plan work, is it? That's actually... Yeah, that's an actual frame. Why aren't the builders doing anything? Where are the builders? Builders? Oh well. They're down there. I have no idea. Oh, it's because I prioritised pipes. That's why. Do I have deployment? I do, right. Deployment. Everybody in there. One in the canteen. One in the common one. One in the yard. And that'll pretty much do for now. Also, we need an entrance into here. Now, objects. Door. Oh, actually, only a staff door will make it to there. All right, there we go. So, go back into planning. So, what do they need? They need a canteen and kitchen. So, here, if we as a table is four along, and then a bench on either side. So, bench... Oh, wait, actually, it's a lot easier if we change it and make it an object. So, four along is a table. My OCD's kicking in. So, bench, 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 table. Bench, bench, table. Bench, bench, table. That'll be fine. And then... Table, table. Mm, we could actually have it just leaned up. Okay, that, that's a perfect size. Kitchen. Um, honestly, again, not that many prisoners. So, like this, what we can do is have it like that and then have like laundry or something there. And then we've just got random places for different things. I think that's a good enough. Like, that'll be adequate size. We can always expand if we need to. If we don't, then great. Uh, let's speed it up, though. So we do have our prisoners now in the prison. So this is first meal time. So let's see if there's any fights. Let's hope. There's a fight. There's a, there's a death. Was that? Oh, no. He's just killed for being a snitch. God damn it, John Co Cox. Yeah, John Cox. Yep, this is why you need to separate. So I might actually, for now, just put minimum security and protected custody together. Um... Because I don't really want them to die, like, all the time. All right, that door's going in, so this will make the morgue complete. Uh, any second. This is the morgue room, so there we go. And then in the morgue, we need some morgue slabs. Um, that should do, and flip it around. We're expecting a lot of people to die. <laughs> uh. All right, I also want to start working on the um, remote door system. Oh, wait, I actually don't know if I need that. I might do. I'm not sure. I, I know it's not that specific door that you actually get. It's something else. Is it in utilities? No. I think you need the security room or something like that. Um. Oh, yeah. How did the heating do? I think the heating is working. We just didn't put radiators in as of yet. Utilities. So we can do it. Oh, God. They still haven't completed a lot of this. That's weird. It says that water isn't hot, but then the water starts getting hot like three blocks out. Well, if it's working, I guess it's working. <laughs> working as intended. All right, here, here, and here. I think I put them on the left side. Did I put it on the left? No, I didn't. Oh, wait, no, I made the pipe go that way, so that will be fine. All right. They'll eventually get around to everything that I need. Let's speed it up. How's it going? So one person died, but so far, so good. No one else. As long as like, not a lot of people are dying, I think we're good. Oh, I need a cleaning cupboard. Okay. Um, maybe we should put the cleaning cupboard like here. Yeah. Put it like here. That'll be good. And then jail door, we'll put one there. Because this is going to be a separation. You're, no, you're not allowed to go this way if you're not like a certain prisoner. Have I just got, like, no workers? What? I'm really confused. Go, builders. So I just I hired four more. Let's get 12 builders so they can start building. Yeah, so all my builders are somewhere busy that I would have thought they would have completed ages ago. Intelligence! Right. Um, so our dangers. You can see that they can get all this stuff. I'm an idiot. I just forgot something really important. Let's put that more in there. I need uh, metal detectors. I completely forgot. We're going to start stockpiling these. Metal detectors. Uh, they go... They come from the yard. So two in there. Every single door of the yard is going to have two metal detectors. 
the canteen, two metal detectors, common room, metal detector. We're going nuts. Uh, out of your cell block here, metal detectors. Any way that they can get to the further of the prison, there are going to be metal detectors. Also, we'll have, we'll have two just randomly here. So if they're coming in and out of there, that's also good. Look at our prisons just randomly. This is why I like setting this to, like, staff only, the reception. It's maybe why I shouldn't have visitation coming off the, this. Because you just randomly have prisoners right near the entrance. You're like, um... That doesn't seem very safe. I'm just, just saying. But it should be okay. Okay, so let's start hooking these bad boys up. So we got there. We may as well hook that one up there. Um... This should get built. So yeah, they, they all should be done. It's just they're, now they're busy with this. Okay, there's that's all built. Lovely. That will be done. Is anybody getting visitors? Oh yeah, I should probably deploy someone in there. Because, you know, you never know if a, an angry family member is uh, angry, really. Okay, food time. Everybody, 94 prisoners have been currently fed. 96. Is everybody getting fed? 96 is still pretty good. <laughs> Means four people are getting a meal, but maybe they don't deserve one. You never know, right? Utilities, uh, make that down there. That should be done there. Getting there, we're getting there. Um, these two, they, they'll get power. Nice. All right, is this done? It's about to be. Okay, what we're also going to do, preemptively, is we're going to build this, this its own power facility. So whenever you're new, and I know a lot of people that just picked up the game because of this series, a lot of people always get caught out and don't understand the power. So just to explain, this power, this bar here, it basically tells you how much more power remaining you have on this unit. We're also, while we're here, may as well, um, going to just add the remaining capacitors so we never run out. But the problem is, is once this reaches full, you cannot get any more power from this. And the annoying thing, which I don't really understand why they have done it that way, is you cannot... Um, wait, we'll have a staff door. You cannot, unfortunately, intertwine power stuff. So if you have one power station here, in the cables, you cannot connect one power station to another power station. They have to be completely separate on a different grid. And a lot of people don't understand that when they first begin. And trust me, I was there with you. But water pumps, by the way, are fine. Water pumps don't have a limit. But power does for some reason. So we can bring the pipes all the way down. Into the corridor over here, up there, down here, and over there. This also does apparently not have a door. Um, door that, door that, and deployment. No access, but there will be in a second. And then logistics, not logistics, deployment. Yep. Uh, Minsec. This is Minsec only. This is Minsec only. So they're not allowed to come in here now if they're only Minsec. And we're going to move all the Minsec prisoners in here. Also along with protective custody, I think. If I can. Come on. Is someone not putting a door? Put a door down. I'm prioritizing the door. There we go. Ta-da! Now you have access, everybody. Go forth and build. Alright, so this was going to be the cleaning cupboard. Cleaning cupboard is a little bit uh, worrisome because um, they can get poison from here. So what I'm probably going to do is I'm not going to even give prisoners jobs in the cleaning cupboard. I just got the, the grant done. Alright, patrols. Let's go for patrols and intelligence again. Informant. We do want to try and get an informant. I can't exactly remember how you get one because again I haven't played this game very seriously uh, or recently but um, yeah right we also have uh, utilities need to plug these two in there which should be done so all of them are now done so if people are trying to sneak stuff well there's a fight going on really death this guy just killed oh my god this guy just killed a guard has he just been bumped up to max sec? Where is he? Did he go? Where did he go? Did he go here? Him? Yeah, they just put him to maximum security. He just literally just murdered a guy. He was in minimum security. What? Oh, he's a legendary prisoner. Oh. Wait, he might be the gang one. Look how much strength he has. 
Can we get him as an AI? An informant? Yes. We want him. Come over here. All right. Hang on. Pause. Um, recruit informant. Confidential informant. So we've got a legendary prisoner. He literally legendary is like the, the hardest to deal with prisoners, and he's gonna be our informant potentially. Wow, he is our con wow. I'm really happy that we got him. It means that he shouldn't kick up a fuss. Like he should be kind of nicely behaved, uh, most likely. Right. So we've got the power station here now. Well, we don't. We don't yet. And we're also gonna just throw some. <laughs> I've lost capacitor. There they are. Right where I was on. May as well. It's a lot of money, but I like being prepared. And then we're going to start powering this place. All the way down. In there. In there. In there. In there. Out to the corridor. Because this now is going to be its own separate grid. So you see these two? These two can never connect. Because it would, it would like haywire the whole system. Um, I think that is already... No, it is... Failed two times. Why has it been failed? Who's doing this job? Someone? Hello? Let's speed it up. Hello? It is... Con I'm control left clicking. It is prioritized, but just apparently nobody's doing it. Um, Is he fighting again? No, you're our informant, you bum. All right, let's just punish him by putting him in solitary. This adds up, by the way. So we're going to put him in solitary confinement for three days. And hopefully that will calm him down. But he's, a, he's an informant. He should be behaving now, you would think. Oh, I heard an electric or a beepy thing go off from a uh, thing. Apparently that one pipe has been done and nothing else. Right, let's get rid of the power station and try to rebuild it. Because apparently that wasn't going to work for whatever reason. Prison's running okay, though. I'm definitely happy with this prison and the, the first one we were doing. Apparently, there's no power in here. What's happening now? Is there another fight? What are you doing? Why are you fighting? You're not a le legendary either, are you? No, you're not. Why are you fighting if you're not a legendary? He's Blitzcrank! Okay, so apparently there's a lot of riots happening now. Why are people angry? What do you want? Drugs? Exercise? Yeah, you can go and exercise. Oh, there's a lot of fights. Oh, God. Oh, God. Come on, guys. You can you can stop this fight. Let's just slow it down for a second. What's happening? So, do they just want to exercise? Family, family. They should be able to... Have, yeah, look. Visitation's actually happening this time. That's good. Maybe we need a bigger visitation with the booths. So, they're on the phone. They're talking. They want recreation. They've got a common room they can go chill out in. They can go have fun. That's no problem. They can exercise here. They've got everything that they need. They, there's, there's no issues here. They're just being... They're just moaning. I think some of them... There's another fight. Kill him! Oh, is that the legendary? No, it's not. Unknown reputation. God, this is a nightmare right now. Maybe it's the implementation of the um, metal detectors, because I hear them quite a bit, so maybe people are getting found out, and that's making them quite angry. Right, let's also start introducing some programs, because a lot of people are also complaining. Let's put some parole hearings, and let's put... Um... Where's this one? Okay, there we go. We need drug addiction one because we definitely need that. And behavioral therapy. So where does the... Okay, so the behavior, that behavioral therapy happens here in his office. So people will go there in a second. And he's, he's giving behavioral therapy. He's teaching people how to be calm. Isn't that nice? This person. So this person is going to try and get calmer. There we go. That's good. And then this one is going to happen as well. That they all just sit in the beds. Nice. This is happening between 10 and 11 a.m. Are they allowed to do stuff at 10 and 11 a.m.? Just checking. It has to be free time, I believe. I've come... Where the hell? Uh, where's my timetable? It has to be 10 and 11. Yeah, work free time. Perfect. It fits in nicely. We also found someone having a drill just then. That's a bit worrying. Not going to lie. Okay, I think the prison's calmed down. I think we just had a little bit of a panic. People getting angry. Uh, this still hasn't been built. What the hell is going on? They have pure access here, right? I'm not going nuts. So they can go in there. They can go up. And they can get in there. There we go. They can get in there. That's no problem. There's a door open there. Yeah, I don't honestly know why there's such a big problem. 
Really don't know why. Uh, also, when we get later into the game, um, with deployment, you can actually have deployment schedules and like when certain people are going to be in certain places and making sure that you can like have people covering it at all times. It's really good. Um, I think it's just the sheer amount of pipe work and stuff that they're getting flooded down with instead of actually in, in doing this. Like I'm, I am clicking the left control and all this good stuff, but unfortunately it's not actually making it prioritize. Maybe you can't prioritize one of those. Maybe it's a bug. I'm not sure. Food time. Is it people getting angry? Nope, no far. These people got flagged on the metal detector. Okay, so people want spirituality. I completely forgot about the one. I will be honest, I'm not the uh, most spiritual person myself, so sometimes I forget people need it. Um, where are we going to build it, though? I've kind of encap... Aha! Perfect. I was like, I've kind of encapsulated this whole place. No, I didn't. And then two like that. Nice. I can't remember how much a chapel has to be. A chapel has to be six by six. Six. Oh, well, perfect. It fits down there. That's nice. So we'll build just a row of stuff down here because we're going to build stuff down there eventually. Um, we'll put a... People are arguing again. Stop it. Stop it. I think everybody's relatively happy. I think there's just a couple of troublemakers every now and then. Which isn't a huge deal. I think it'll be fine eventually. Let's speed up again. I, it's really confusing how this just isn't being done very quick. I'm going to be honest. My workers are just maybe a bad. Let's employ a couple more. Let's get up to 16 workers. Maybe they'll help. So they're, oh, they're actually building this. Not the one I wanted them to build. I actually wanted them to finish this over here. Because th these flashing night lights are annoying me. But anyway... All right, they got free time, so a lot of them are going back to their cells, going to the toilet. Might be useful just to plot a couple of toilets randomly around the prison, so people aren't cunt, um, aren't found unawares. Because again, that can get people angry. Um, they're cutting down the trees. We will definitely be making a workshop, probably, probably here, most likely. You just got to be careful of workshops because they can get weapons. In workshops, you see. I just realised my solitary cells are the mean ones, so they don't actually have toilet access. That guy that I put in there for three days will not have a toilet for three days or a shower. You'll get food. You do get food if you're in solitary. And uh, brick wall. There, thank you. And then utilities. Let's bring this over here. What happened? I think there was just a moment that prisoners could escape, but they they, they fixed itself really quickly. Right, let's make it go down here. Wonderful. Wunderbar. And let's build a chapel. Like this. Six by six. So we can make the corridor go here. And then down to the ground down there. And then make another wall go here. And have a door like that. Lovely. That should work quite nicely, I think. That will give them their spiritual needs that a lot of them... Actually, we'll make it longer, right? We don't need to, like, um, make it so narrow. We can make it a bit longer so we could actually fit more people in. I'm sure people would want that. Everyone's having their showers. Wonderful, wonderful. Um, and now the brick should be starting. Yes, it is. And we can put in objects. So... Altar at the front. I do know... Oh, God, that's really close. I do know how they look. I have been in the odd church or two. And then we'll put pew. All right. Uh, there. There, there, there. That should be enough. And then prayer mats down there. That works, right? That, I think, looks quite good. And then we need to make a program that a spiritual leader uh, comes in. And does a, a, what are they, ceremony or something? Spiritual guidance. 14 in queue. Wow, a lot of them need this. All right, start. There we go. Look how many. Between 10 and 12, there's going to be a massive, like, thing. That's cool. That means people are going to get that, that need completed, which apparently is a need that people need to, because, you know, it's one of those things that makes people angry in this game, which is good. Like laundry. We, we don't want the great spiritual riots of my prison. I, you know, that, that would be nice if we could avoid that. That would be great. All right, put power down there. We will eventually get onto this, I guess. 
Um, we won't... Mm, I'm just going to give it power. I'm not going to sort it out yet. i just get rid of the flashing. If we need... Because, hang on. Did I... Intelligence, not intelligence, logistics, temperature. So definitely these sucks are really cold. These are all nice and toasty because utilities. How far? Let's let's see how far the hot water goes up. If it can get up here, we can put a radiator here from this one little boiler. That would be great. I doubt it, but you never know. Um. Oh, are they done finally. God, that took them a while, didn't it? Right, so we can now start building this little room here. So what was today's goals? It was research all that stuff and it was actually start to put together the low security slash protected custody wing. We, we've pretty much done everything. You know, I like setting goals myself every episode and try to hit it because you hit it. You're like, hey, I, I did it. If you didn't, then you know what you're doing next episode. Um, yeah. All right, down there, 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 there. And then this, and this, and this, and then we'll we'll close this off right now. We'll make this just a storage or something. Um, and then we need to put doors because I always forget to put the doors, and then people get locked. So this will be a staff door from the corridor. We won't even have access into it from here. And then jail door, or is this? This is going to be canteen. This was going to be laundry, and that was going to be kitchen. Nice. We'll also give them their own parole room. Like, this is what I mean. You just give everything that they need in one area for, like, low and minsec people, and then they shouldn't die, which is nice. <laughs> it's always good when you can stop people dying. Uh, objects, bed. We could have actually given these people, like, um, we could have made it all bunk beds, but... Eh. Because, like, you don't want to give people bunk beds that potentially can fight, but all Minsec people really shouldn't fight. Unless they're randomly a legendary prisoner that we got earlier, which is really random. It's actually surprising we got a legendary prisoner this early into this playthrough, to be honest. They're usually a late game thing when your prison can handle them a bit better. Because that, uh, that guy, literally, he's going to fight all the time. Even though he's one of our informants, he probably is going to fight all the time. And he's the most likely one uh, that would kill snitches if he finds out who they are. He'll just kill them straight away without hesitation. So you've got to be careful of legendary prisoners. I haven't had that many. They are, again, they're, they're quite rare. So that's why I was so surprised that we had one already. Um, make sure I'm putting drains on the showers, not the toilets. And also brick wall randomly we missed a couple utilities yes 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 uh, up and down and then you can just put it like that that should reach I will also do heating relatively early too um, so staff and rooms let's actually fill in the rooms before I do anything so canteen canteen kitchen kitchen Laundry, laundry, lovely. Um, okay, so what did I? What was I saying? I was gonna do. I was gonna do table there, table there, table there, and table there, and then it would be bench, 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 bench. That's probably enough actually for now. We'll see. Uh, serving tables, we're going to go here. Damn it. That doesn't fit in like the way I want it to. So we'll have one there and then we'll have one there. Yeah, We can fit in the tables elsewhere. Alright, cookers up here. We need a sink. Not a shower head. A sink and fridges at the bottom. With having, not doctors, two cooks. They'll eventually swap over to here. Laundry we'll have uh, laundry baskets along there laundry machines and ironing boards like that right um we also before we do anything hang on intake uh closed the reason why we're going to close it is we want to make sure that all these prisoners move into here before we actually do anything else 
Um, did I set everything? Without, well, no bookshelves yet, but we'll get on to that. Just making sure that every cell has what it needs. No access in there. Mm. Should we just put a random door? Because, again, these are just going to be, like, parole rooms and stuff like that. And then, again, this one doesn't have any. So we'll put one there. Lovely. Okay. Um, I think that's pretty much everything we wanted to do in today's episode. So... Next episode, we're going to look to maybe getting a workshop here for these people, moving all the minimum security and try to expand on our informants and try to learn a little bit more about intelligence. Um, so if you guys do enjoy this series, make sure you keep supporting it by watching and liking the video. If you do, it really does help. I'm enjoying doing the, this series thoroughly, and this is something, like I mentioned, I think, last episode, is that when Season 7 League of Legends comes about, the main channel is going to be all League of Legends, and the, the second channel, Huzzy Extra, is where I'm going to do this type of thing more. Um, so yeah, like it, subscribe. See you guys next time. Peace.